simple designs came to be. Butterfly wings are actually transparent. These transparent wings are covered with scales of varying thicknesses. Some small scales arranged in a row on top of the wing break the light falling on them up into the colors of the rainbow. Some scales reflect a particular shade of light. What is surprising is that these tens of thousands of scales are arranged according to a definite plan. As a result of this planned arrangement, wings appear with wonderfully harmonious colors and striking designs. The colors and designs on butterflies' wings are not only strikingly beautiful, but also perform a vital function. On the wings of some butterflies, there are dark spots formed by scales. These spots have the ability to regulate heat. A butterfly that needs to warm its body opens and closes its wings so as to allow the sunlight to fall on these spots. In this way, it receives the heat it needs to be able to fly. Here is an engineering design that makes optimum use of light. The existence of such an extraordinarily beautiful sight is a proof of the supreme power and artistry of Allah. In the Quran, Allah says, Everything in the heavens and the earth glorifies Allah. He is the Almighty, the All-Wise. The kingdom of the heavens and the earth belongs to Him. He gives life and causes to die. He has power over all things. The aesthetic appearance of birds' bodies is one of the most evident proofs that Allah created living things. The structure of birds reveals another perfect design. A range of color is produced by the pigments in their feathers and the play of light on them. Feathers are made of keratin and due to environmental conditions they wear out within a short time. Yet, each time a bird has its colorful wings restored because, even if their wings wear out, Allah has created a system that continues to restore them to their original condition. There are other uses for the pigments that give wings their color. They increase the wings' resilience, store heat from the sun, and prevent dangerous ultraviolet light from penetrating birds bodies. A bird's color can serve various purposes. For example, these two birds blend into their environment thanks to their colors. This male bird you can see has a plumage of white, red and blue. By displaying this plumage with its incomparable designs, he tries to attract the female. The peacock is one of the showiest of all colorful birds. In order to attract the opposite sex, the peacock opens his splendid tail and displays the marvelous designs on it. He opens it like a fan, and the delicately worked and beautifully colored designs attract the female. The advocates of the theory of evolution, which claims that living things came about by chance, can offer no explanation for this marvelous design. The design of the tail of a peacock is so elaborate and perfect that Charles Darwin, the founder of the theory of evolution, said, Now trifling particulars of structure often make me very uncomfortable. The sight of a feather in a peacock's tail, whenever I gaze at it, makes me sick. 
Darwin was uneasy over the splendor of wings because it is evident that such splendor could not have been the result of unconscious chance. The countless colors and various designs in birds' wings are proofs of the supreme artistry and knowledge in Allah's creation. He is Allah, the creator, the maker, the giver of form. To him belong the most beautiful names. Everything in the heavens and earth glorifies him. He is the Almighty, the All-Wise. There are millions of different living things in the sea. It is difficult to make out most of these creatures in their environment. Take scorpion fish, for example. Scorpion fish live on the seabed in mid-tropical zones. The fins on the breast of these fish are weapons used to repel enemies. Scorpion fish have an extremely colorful appearance. And because the coral in which they live is also very colorful, they can easily hide in it. This reduces the danger of them falling prey to predators and also makes it easier to catch their own prey. Some small creatures live in this coral. Let's look a bit more closely. Seahorses. The colors and protrusions on the bodies of seahorses are exactly the same color as those of the coral in which they live. Seahorses are camouflaged among all that coral. Because of this, it is impossible for their predators to recognize them or their young. The nudie branch is a species of slug. With its extremely attractive appearance, it is one of the most interesting creatures in the sea. It has very interesting designs and bright colors on it. And it has an extremely soft body with no shell to protect it. This external appearance is very attractive to other creatures, but the striking colors of this sea slug announce to predators that it is very poisonous. In other words, because of its colors, 